Um, so Master Wong, obviously we've just been talking about the jab and moving back. Now, say you're not too confident and you're not sure if you want to go after them when they jab because mm. they might follow up with something else because mm. obviously that's a possibility. Especially with a lot of boxers and kickbox, that kind of thing. They might chuck a jab but then come straight in with a straight punch. Very good. This is human being asked question. Yeah. Not a dummy. Right. A dummy is fake. Dummy is just like uh, you punch and then you punch again. See? Yeah. This is human being. Human being respond. Yeah. yeah. It's very, very good question. The idea you have to understand is all the time will identify the threat, what's going on. Right. What is the situation you're in first? Mm -hmm. Okay. If you turn around, if we are just a normal fan mm -hmm. and we're talking, you're punching, yeah. and then you're punching, it's easy. I yeah. can do whatever I want. Yeah. That's safe in the club. Yeah. yeah. Safe but environment. Safe for the environment because yeah. you've got everything there. Yeah. But in the street and somebody uh, do that, you attack somebody, I'm not sure I move. Yeah. Then I come. So the idea, the movement to work like this is fit work and hand and feet, yeah. everything have to be coordinated. So you attack coming again, come boom, here, and then boom, straight away. That is the first yeah. line of thread. So you slowly want to yeah. connect line. You move. Yeah. Quickly rush. Yeah. When you quickly rush, that means you're already attacking yeah. the face, so you won't be know what I'm doing. Yeah. That none of you not. Yeah. But because I lie to you, I boom to your sober plan. That still kill you. But at least you still got a nut to play with at night time. Yeah, I appreciate that. So that's the most important thing is you need to move. So you attack how many, you need to respond hard, boom! Keep hold of the movement that you can yeah. here. Because if you hit me that side, oh, then I'm floor you easily, take yeah. you down. But if you are attacking that same using move I just done, yeah. I'm attacking it, I'm here, yeah. and I take all of that, move back, move, I miss you, yeah. But this is where. It's important to identify the situation and then deal with it. So what you need to do is when you attack coming from there, move back, boom, back, boom, move, yeah. move, move. Yeah. You're not gonna go nowhere. I can't get away. Yeah. Because I called you here, yeah. and then I deal with you. Yeah. Maybe another guy over that side. Maybe here. I don't know. If I'm here, I got chance to do this to you. Yeah. And then I kick you in the head while I'm there with this guy. Yeah. Now what I, it's not one person. It's so many different uh, person. Mm -hmm. So you have to be able to understand the line of what is it. Because if you're punching, I go straight in. See, this is a problem. Yeah. Now, of course, you can turn around. I can do that. Yeah. But if it's that not quick enough, yeah. I don't want to gamble. Yeah, 50-50 yeah, chance. I mean, if I go outside and I light my face, I got a party to go to. I don't want to be like that, do I? And I go like that and I, hmm. And I'm like, what happened to you? You get knocked out, yeah. so I play safe. You attack, I move, but then I attack. Then I come in, yeah. then I need your nut. And then I drop your head up, and then I go and get my nice tree. Yeah. Is that my sense here? Yeah, yeah that makes perfect sense. That's because all the time I defend, depending on safety of yourself, mm. must come first. Yeah. Don't gamble. No. Yeah? We'll because lose. you lose. 50 <laughs> 50 is, I don't like that. I like to be 100%. Okay. Does that answer the question yet? Yeah, yeah, that has, yeah, thanks a lot. That's a puppy. Sometimes depend on the situation you're in. If you're moving back, keep a distance, then you can come in. And then of course, you can knee them in a nut so they got no more nut left, so they can't play with themselves at night time. If that's what they're doing all the time. Or you come in and knee them on a sober plaque, and that's where they got clap their lungs. They're still in a shit. So this depends what you want to do. That's answer your question.